Hello everyone, uh, in this video tutorial I'll examine the circuit, a low pass circuit inside a typical CAN transmission line. So this, is, this style of circuit is called split termination where you have the termination load split in two and then you, you feed the common a node to a capacitor that forms a low pass filter and that creates a corner at this uh, at this frequency 1 over 2 pi r c l but in this uh, application note r is not clearly defined what r is but they did give us an example where c l is given as 4.7 nanofarad and they say the corner is at 1.1 megahertz so that's implying a, a r value of 30 ohms so I mean, for first, uh, I look at this and it's like, how do you get 30 ohms from this circuit and how would you analyze this circuit? So this is what this tutorial is about, how do you derive the trans function um, given the circuit. So this low pass filter has to do with a um, low, um, filtering the common mode signal to stabilize the, the CAN uh, um, transmission line. So what we do is we are going to draw the circuit out like this. All right. Here's R R C. Right. Now we got to define what's the voltage at this point. So this the voltage here is just. V common that's um, V common plus differential uh, positive differential, and this is reference to ground. Okay, now we can re rewrite this as reference to ground. So this signal right here is a common mode signal plus uh, a positive differential, and this right here is now V common mode minus some V differential. All right. Now we know that these two nodes share the same common mode. So we can now redraw the circuit as V common mode I'll make it clear. It's just going to do like this. Right. This is actually the output uh, point we're analyzing. All right. Since these are two the same, we just tie it together. So this point is just the common mode, right? And it's referenced to the ground. So now this is just a simple circuit where you have two resistors in parallel connected to a capacitor. So now you see that this is a simple RC low pass filter. Here's V out. So the the corner of this is just now 1 over 2 pi r over 2 c right so r in the example they, they, they give us is 60 ohms and c is 4.7 and if you do the calculation for that you know FC equals 1 over 2 pi 60 ohms divided by 2 times 4.7 nanofarad 60 ohms that's going to give you the 1.1 megabits per second or megahertz uh, that they have in, in the application notes so 
this is how you analyze that circuit. Thanks for watching. Um, I'll see you next time. Leave in the comments.